yeah, pictures. Yeah, I love well, it. Good day. We are having a fantastic time at the Detail Summit in Edmonton, Canada. It's been an amazing two and a half days, and I only almost got run over once by this guy. <laughs> That's right. Maybe on purpose. <laughs> Maybe on purpose. It was per totally on purpose. And uh, yeah, that, so, so if, if you, you don't know this guy, this is one of the legends in the industry, Carter from Handicap and Hustlin'. He's got a full line of products and he's uh, kicking. Who's your right hand man there? Oh, yeah. Oh. No, uh, not Paolo, that guy. Paolo, but I'll be right here. Yes. But no, this is Tristan. Yep. I have no idea why I have him. <laughs> <laughs> you don't know why you have him. So this is your, kind of your, you, you answered the wrong ad. It said detailer and you ended up being yeah. more than, and duty, other duties as assigned. Other duties. Way more of a duty. Yeah. The ad just said detailer. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, that's good. So how long have you been working with Carter? Since November. Good. November. Going on a year then. You guys seem months. to be a good team. Oh, so. for sure. Yeah. That's, that's good. great. Well, so a couple times, but I say it's only about one two times a week. I want to kill him. <laughs> <laughs> no, it goes both ways. That's right. <laughs> so, well, well they, he has the advantage. He can drop you when he's moving you, yeah, right? Yeah. <laughs> Possibly. So, you no, know, no, this pad's going no, down. So that, that's awesome. So you know, we've been here three days. Yeah. So what has been really impactful for you as you've come to the Detail Summit? Just meeting uh, industry leaders, that's the main part, and getting to know people. Yep. Like I've been to a couple of things before, and every single one is amazing. Yeah. yeah. Yep. Get your hands on new machines, yeah. polish them with different stuff, and uh, then different ceramic coatings. The, the, the OP ceramic coating that we used, I thought was... A, Pretty yeah. awesome coating, pretty easy to deal with, and you got your hands on a rotary there for a while, and it's scary. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, and you brought your Rupes machine. Yeah. It was cool to see you up there polishing the hood of that thing. Yeah, that thing is amazing. Thanks to you guys and to your kids. Uh, that thing's awesome. The only way I can polish a car, so. Yeah. Thank you. Guys. No, oh, that was, yeah, no, it, it was totally. just cool to see you just, using it, awesome. it. And I mean, you were up there with just precision, dialing in that, oh, that yeah. polish. That was good. Yeah. So that's good. Yeah. So Tristan, let's talk about you, you know, working as a partner with Carter. Mm -hmm. How's the event been for you? It's been really good. I'm. <laughs> <laughs> when we had what are you laughing about last <laughs> night or something? <laughs> <laughs> I'm good with one-on-ones when there's a lot of people on me. When we had to introduce ourselves, it scared me a lot. It yeah. took me out of my comfort zone and learning all these things, I think it's really good. Um, we'll have to come back again. I'm learning a lot. Yep. And so you guys are, if you, for those of you that don't know, you are in a place called Medicine Hat. Yeah, Medicine Hat. And it is, how far is it from like Calgary? Uh, about three hours. About three yeah, hours three outside hours. of Calgary. So you, are you in, uh, is it more of an industrial farming? Is it more just what? Oil and gas. Oil and, Oil gas. and gas. Okay. That's good. There you middle go. Of nowhere. In the middle of freaking nowhere. We are in a big city in the area. It's still not that big. Yeah, yeah. we're in the desert. I think we have 65,000 people total, and we're the biggest area around us. Wow. Okay. Yeah. yeah. That's fun. So what's yeah, your... It's not fun. It's not fun? <laughs> <laughs> You'd rather be back in uh, Calgary? Yeah. <laughs> we were talking about that last night. You were trying to convince him to move back to Calgary, yeah. and he's like, wait, business is just starting to get going, man. I, I don't know. I have such a big time telling Calgary. Yeah. Yeah. Well, you know, maybe you just drag him along. You know, you get time to the back of your chair and just drag him yeah, right. all the way there. Oh, yeah, right. <laughs> yeah. There you go, handcuffs. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so what, what's your biggest takeaway from the event? Oh, there's so much. The, the leather repair stuff is insane. I cannot wrap my brain around it at yeah. all. There's a lot there. It's something I really want to get into, but man, there's so much. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, it's it's so, I think once once Richard starts talking and it opens up your eyes to all of the different materials that are used. I mean, prior to that, you think of like, oh, well, there's leather and there's vinyl, you know, and then you're like, oh my God, there's, 
10 different leathers and there's five different products that are a mixture of this and that and Richard has all of that knowledge from 40 years of yeah, knowing this. Amazing. So and and then the nice thing about that is you guys have Apollo who's leather repair company distributor Canada. right here and they've gone through that training. They're actually certified trainers. So you guys have somebody here that can do that. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. It's a different beast, right? It is. It, it is. I tried definitely. to get him to sew up a spot on my back, but he wouldn't do it. <laughs> yeah. So anyway, man, it's it has been an amazing couple days. Thank you for making it yeah. always so fun. Yeah. I mean, we're always laughing, kidding, and and growing and learning. Yeah. And we're, I'm always inspired by what you do, man. Your passion, your dedication to your craft is amazing. So. Guys, um, look out for another detail summit coming near you. Rod and I are going to be bouncing in a little bit, and it's just been amazing. Thank you to the Edmonton crew. It's been awesome. So. It has been. So uh, get involved in these summits. They're super positive. They are, they're not scary. You might be scared when you first come in, but everybody's accepting no matter what level you're at, whether this is your first time touching a polisher or whether you're, you know, Bob Myers and you've had a polish in your hand since birth. <laughs> so, you know. Yep, so talk to you later. Yeah. Bye. See ya. See ya. <laughs>